the Bible tells us in the book of Genesis is the beginning. And in the beginning, God created the heavens and the earth. Now the earth was formless and empty, darkness was over the surface of the deep, and the Spirit of God was hovering over the waters. And God said, Let there be light, and there was light. God saw that the light was good, and he separated the light from the darkness. God made two great lights, the greater light to govern the day and the lesser light to govern the night. He also made the stars. Then God said, Let us make mankind in our image, in our likeness, so that they may rule over the fish in the sea and the birds in the sky over the livestock and all the wild animals, and over all the creatures that move along the ground. Notice the words, let us, meaning that Jesus was with the Father and the Holy Spirit. And Jesus, the Son of God, paid the price of our sins on the cross to save us. So God created mankind in his image, in the image of God he created them, male and female he created them. God not only created Adam and Eve in his image of mankind, but also executed the first wedding and authorized them to be one and be fruitful. God blessed them and said to them, Be fruitful and increase in number, fill the earth and subdue it. Rule over the fish in the sea, the birds in the sky, and every living creature that moves on the ground. Today is Saturday, November 19th in the year 2022. Miss Gracie Torres and Mr. Scott Condit, by the grace of God will be united as husband and wife. Pastor Vicente Perez will execute this holy ceremony in the Church of Emmanuel Assembly of God. Located in the city of Poth, Texas, as God our Father in Haven did in the book of Genesis thousands of years ago. Bridesmaids and groomsmen are as follows. Number one, Monica Leal escorted by Carlos Garcia. Number two, Denise Gonzalez escorted by Pete Leal Jr. Number 3, Caitlin Benavides, escorted by Zane Sanchez. The flower girl is, Carolyn Benavides, escorted by, ring bearer Fernando Benavides Jr. The wedding singers are, Minnie and Gilbert Antuna. The first song is Hallelujah, written by Canadian singer Leonard Cohen in 1984. In Hebrew, the word hallelujah means to rejoice in praising God. Second song is From This Moment written by Canadian singer Shania Twain. She wrote the lyrics while in Italy at a soccer game in 1997. Congratulations to Miss Gracie Torres and Mr. Scott Condit on your blessed wedding day. And now, Miss Gracie Torres and Mr. Scott Condit invite you to join them at their lovely and holy weddings. Thank you. Dear Mr. and Mr. Condit, we have a special surprise for you. From the Dream With Me concert. Ms. Jackie Ivanko singing the Lord's Prayer. Enjoy it.
to other reasons I'm losing my sleep Please come back now So there goes my mind race And you are the reasons That I'm still breathing I'm hopeless now Come every mountain, swim every ocean, just to be with you, fix what I broke, oh, cause I need you to see. I stand to receive the light. As we begin this ceremony, I just want to say a few words of reflection concerning this couple. They've gone through quite a bit of a journey in the past few years, but God has been faithful and is faithful to where He is a God that gives us the desires of our hearts. And it's God, and as well as Gracie, God has to be able to be here among friends and witnesses in this special moment which is your way. John chapter 2, verse 1 and 2 says, On the third day, a wedding took place in Cain, in Galilee. Jesus' mother was there, and Jesus and his disciples had also been invited to the wedding. Scotty Gracie, is it okay if we invite the presence of God into this wedding as well? Yes. Would you join with me in prayer this afternoon? Heavenly Father, we thank you this evening for the opportunity that you give us to celebrate first and foremost life. But also, Lord, an opportunity as you were in the wedding at Canaan for your presence to be here in this wedding of these two special individuals. That, Lord, this afternoon they take their wedding vows to be able to join together as a couple. And God, I thank you for each and every friend and family that is here. We ask that you be with us in this celebration, and we ask all of this in Jesus' name. Amen. Amen. You may. Thirteen, four. You. Love is patient. Love is kind. It does not envy. It does not boast. It is not proud. It is not rude. It is not self-seeking. It is not easily angered. Keeps no record of wrongs. Does not delight in evil. Rejoices in the truth always protects, always trusts, always hopes, always perseveres. Love never fails. I just want to say a few words um, that seven months ago in this very church, my mother suffered a stroke and ended up in the hospital. The realization that her life on earth may soon transition to heaven lit an urgency in my mother and her heart to be right with God and marry her life partner, Scott, They've been engaged for several years. Being here today is a testimony of God's faithfulness. Everything that is meant to be will happen in God's perfect timing. It is an honor for me to be a part of the official union of Mr. and Mrs. Scott Condit. Congratulations on your wedding, and I love you both. Together here today 
to help to people on their way as the bride and groom begin their life together and now we reach their special day we come to celebrate them both and show them how much all we love them too Hallelujah, 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 Hallelujah. Can up the aisle and the groom looks up and gives a smile the love that flows between them fills the church with friends and family at her side she really is the blushing bright with love and pride they lead her hallelujah Comfort you. I promise to comfort you in sickness and in health. In sickness and in health. I promise to demonstrate my commitment to you. I promise to demonstrate my commitment to you. Through love. Through love. Laughter. Laughter. And compassion. And compassion. I love you. As you have exchanged these vows, there is a symbol of affirming these vows that you had just spoken to each other. So hence, we will be presenting your wedding ring.
these rings that you hold in each other's hand. They symbolize the strength of your commitment to this marriage and the love you will share together. Scott, as you place the ring on Gracie's finger, please repeat after me. Gracie with this ring. Gracie with this ring. I pledge my life. I pledge my life. My love. My love. To you. To you. In the name of the Father. In the name of the Father. The Son. The Son. And of the Holy Spirit. And of the Holy Spirit. Gracie, as you place the ring on Scott's finger, please repeat after me. Scott, with this ring, Scott, with this ring, I pledge my life, I pledge my life and, my love to you. and my love to you. In the name of the Father, the, of the, Father the, Son, the Son, and of the Holy Spirit. By the power invested in me by the state of Texas and before these witnesses, it is my great pleasure to pronounce you husband and wife. Scott, you may kiss your bride. I wouldn't give 